let's talk about the hopeful overall impact of this Orange Bowl experience on, on the football program and the university at, uh, at large. Well, I, I think it's a seminal moment for our university. It's one of those kinds of celebrations that uh, the university doesn't come along every year and certainly never has for us. And so to go to the Orange Bowl, to have that opportunity, and we've been talking a long time about being the first team from the MAC mm -hmm. uh, to, to represent that conference in a BCS game. And to do that in the Orange Bowl, I'm so excited about that. And it's, it's something that uh, most of our alums are talking about it. It's, my phone blew up right away, uh -huh. and uh, it's been one of those, those events that I think everyone will remember where they were when they heard about the announcement. Yeah. And I, I heard already that uh, the uh, merchandise sales of NIU t-shirts, yeah. et cetera, has just skyrocketed. So. It has. Uh, we, we heard from our um, licensing group today that uh, the sales for NIU, the Husky stuff, is going off the shelves everywhere. Uh -huh. uh, more online orders than ever. And so um, certainly people are uh, going to our website more than ever before and finding out about the Huskies. Mm -hmm. So it, it's, it's great for us because I think once they start learning about our football team, they start learning about our university. And, you know, it's that old cliche, we're the front porch. I told our trustees today, we have a big front porch. <laughs> and when there's a lot of room uh, for people to come on. And I'm sure you're also proud of the academic success of your, of your athletes. So. I am. Uh, especially today, we had three of our football players named Academic All-American. I think it's the most in Division One football. And I'm really proud of those guys for what they've done. I'm proud of our football team for their GPA. Uh, their graduation rate is 83% number 12 in the country, and we're number 5 in the country in, in APR, which is a really good company to be in. Talk a little bit about uh, Rod Carey, and looks like he, he wants to be here for a while. I think he does. <laughs> you know, he's a Midwestern guy. Mm -hmm. uh, he grew up in Minnesota, played in Indiana, so he's in the right spot, and uh, he's got a great Husky background, you know. Uh, coach Bill Mallory was his head coach who coached here, and Coach Novak was on staff when he was at Indiana as well, so there's a nice Husky historical tie there, which I think is great. And then um, he just loves it here, and you can tell that. And he wants to continue to build this program and, and uh, keep our program intact. And I felt like we've gone from being a pretty good team to now being a great program. And I think he'll uh, allow us to continue that trend. I'm, I'm sure you're hopeful that the uh, home attendance will pick up uh, oh, definitely. after this experience. Right? Yeah, I think people now really believe we're for real. Uh -huh. You know, I, I'm not sure they really believe that until now. Uh -huh. But now it's like, yeah, they're going to the Orange Bowl. They are for real. Uh -huh. And because of that, um, I think a lot more interest will happen and a lot more pride in our alumni base to come out and see what this team and our university is all about. Well, congratulations, Jeff. Thank you so much.